one can be the disciple of jesus only when he or she obeys the master and follows his commandments in today's gospel we hear a woman from the crowd saying to jesus blessed is the womb that bore you and the breast at which you nursed but jesus in reply said blessed rather are those who hear the word of god and observe it a glance at the words of the woman makes us understand that she is making a direct reference to his mother but jesus's response to her claim seems to be that he is evading from the reference she is making the purpose of jesus's mission is very clear in luke chapter 4 verses 8 to 9 when he reads the passage from the prophet isaiah the spirit of the lord is upon me because he has anointed me to preach good news to the poor he has sent me to proclaim release to the captives and recovery of sight to the blind to set at liberty those who are oppressed to proclaim the acceptable year of the lord this prophecy is fulfilled in the life of jesus for he obeyed his father who sent him even to the point of death now jesus demands that same obedience from his disciples too if any man would come after me let him deny himself and take up his cross and follow me therefore one can be the disciple of jesus only when he or she obeys the master and follows his commandments applying this principle we can conclude that mother mary is the greatest and the most loving disciple of jesus she is the one who followed him from the womb till the tomb who truly understood her son and loved him in return now when the woman in the passage made the claim that blessed is the womb that bore you and the breast at which you nursed Jesus was not evading from her reference made to his mother rather he was strengthening her claim because Jesus knew that Mary's blessedness consisted not merely because she bore him in her womb and by her breast fed him but also because she said yes to the message of an angel and lived by those words in other words she is blessed because she heard the word of god and observed it as the gospel says therefore dear brothers and sisters the message is very clear for us if we are to hear these words from jesus we must listen to his words and teachings and also live by them only then we will be his worthy disciples amen